When you grow up in a working class family, you learn how to get up every day and do your job. There's no getting up in the morning and thinking that you can put something off till tomorrow. You know that every day you wake up, there are certain things that have to get done before you're done for the day. That was the way I was raised. You know, I've always felt that way, and whether it was teaching high school or coaching football or recruiting, you know, when the job was there to be done, you felt like you needed to get it done, and it didn't matter you know, what the hours were that it entails. Um, you know, Coach Flood is a, you know, he's not a screamer, he's not a yeller, but he's definitely not somebody that's a, a pushover. Coach Flood is a guy who, who drives us. And a guy that we all adjust to well, you know, the, the team, everybody. I mean, obviously, it's his first time being the head coach, but I don't think, it doesn't seem like it's his first rodeo, so. The comfort level that we have with him is just kind of crazy. So, uh, he's definitely somebody who's earned the respect of probably everybody in the program. Go, fight! Yeah. There you go, Duran. I actually love the way he's handling things, you know, the, how he's handling the media, how he's handling the pressure. Sorry, coach. I'm so sorry, coach. Real man coming to the team. Yep. Sorry about that. Uh, I think he has the same style he had as an offensive line coach. He's a player's coach guy, meaning that he's he's fun to be around with. You know what I mean? Good. Steve Barnes. I don't know. Burton County guy. That's it, Juwan. Good. Make him bring you the ball. Good. Make him bring you the ball. You know, just a good person. Obviously, and but he's you know he's fired about fired up about the game, fired up about the season. Now that he's running the show, I, I, I mean I know him a lot. And uh, I don't know his presence is real comfortable, real calm. For he's definitely got a style. Jukes from at 20, 15, 10. Coleman is gonna go. Good night, Jawan Jamison is there. Pressure coming and they got him. Not one of the best defenses in college football for no reason. He's definitely more hip than probably most coaches. If you if you want to check his uh his iPod, and you know we all we all respect him. I think it's gonna be that's gonna pay dividends for us in the end because I think he's a really uh, a person that everybody respects and wants to you know play for or perform for. All right, Mark, here we go, baby. The most exciting thing to me uh, about being a football coach, and this was an assistant coach or a head football coach, is the relationships with the players. And the opportunity to be a part of a young person's life at a very important time in their life as they're growing up and to ultimately influence that hopefully in a positive way. You know, I know there's no doubt that I'm here today, the person that I am, not only because of my parents, but because of certain key coaches that I had in my life.